This is a, a really interesting organization, fascinating group of people, one nonprofit helping law enforcement find missing and runaway kids at no cost to their parents. The organization is called Saved in America, and they are holding their inaugural fundraiser dinner tomorrow. Here to talk about this uh, life-saving program, uh, the president of Saved in America, Joseph Travers. Good morning. Good morning. Okay, so uh, let's just give people the facts at home about missing kids, missing and runaway kids, especially here in San Diego County what is the reality of their fate if they run away or go missing within the first 48 hours a runaway child will be approached 60% of the time by a sex trafficker so we what we call the first 48 hours that's mm -hmm. when we want to find the child and let and, and the hang up here is that in most cases our police departments our, our detectives are so inundated with other things that they can't get to these kids or these runaways within that golden 48 hours that you're talking about. And that's correct. They don't have the resources. Actually, within 48 hours, the detective might get the case. Wow. His desk. Might, might. Might. But this is a child's life, and you're saying within that same time period, they most likely will be approached. Absolutely. 60% of the time. <sighs> okay. So let's talk about your impressive group, because you are able to have a... I think this this is an amazing statistic. 49 rescues in 39 months. How in the world are you able to accomplish what the police department simply cannot? We have a, an amazing group of volunteers, and they're all licensed private investigators from our case managers, social networking investigators, to former Navy SEALs and former police narcotics gang investigators. Mm -hmm. And what happens, we get a case, our social networking investigator will f actually find where the missing child is and then what we'll do is send our operators our former police officers navy seals in to establish a perimeter get eyes on the runaway and get eyes on the bad guy if, if the bad guys are there mm -hmm. and coordinate with the police and rescue the girl and the bad guy faces justice what do you find when you make that contact with the young person and the perpetrator who is perhaps taking them into the sex trafficking trade what well, do you find what we usually find is 60 percent of the time the runaway has not been trafficked unfortunately 40 percent of the time of the 49 children that we've covered in 34 months mm -hmm have been. Then they need extensive rehabilitation and we have a rehabilitation director that helps the parents with that process. So it is really a remarkable organization and remarkable what you are able to accomplish with a staff of just 28 people. Um, and you are having your very first fundraiser tomorrow to help um, support all of this financially because you do not charge the parents. Is that right? That's correct. We we don't charge the parents. We do have fees, obviously expenses. Equipment is, is the largest right. uh, issue that we have. But we have, you know, gasoline, rent of cars, hotel fees, travel fees, expenses. One child missing from Del Mar, California, we had to recover in Jacksonville, Florida. Oh my goodness. So that, that cost a lot of money for the expense to do that. We figured out each child it takes about five thousand dollars. To recover five thousand wow. dollars, but you know, but to a parent who is desperate to find their child, I'm sure that parent would pay any amount of money well, to find their kid. And some actually do. Right. Some have went through twenty, thirty, forty thousand dollars in private investigation fees. So when they find out about us, that we don't charge them anything, it's all done by donor money. Mm -hmm. So that's what we measure. You know, five thousand dollars, we're going to go find a child. Well, y you have an uh, an amazing organization. Are you based? You're based here in San Diego. Where are you based? Absolutely. Based we're, here we're in San here Diego. In, uh, the headquarters is in Oceanside. Okay. And uh, but we're from San Diego. But we have recovered these 49 children, 20 of which were from San Diego County. Oh my gosh. All over the state of California, as far away as Florida. Well, I'm sure not only are the parents grateful for your help, but also the police department, who we know is is inundated with these types of things. And again, we'll put all that information on our website about the fundraiser. Support this wonderful organization. Thank you so much for your time. Liberty Station tomorrow night. Right? Liberty Station tomorrow all right. night. Thank you, Joseph. Thank you. Nice to meet nice you. To meet you. All right.